Okay, let's see, let's see. Okay, overall energy, justice in reverse, there's a lack of balance here, okay? Something's not fair. You have five of cups on your mind, you're crying over spilled milk, a lot of remorse, regret, or just that you could have handled the situation in a better way, or there's a lot of disappointment about what didn't work out in the past, all right? On their mind is the ace of pentacles. This person wants a new beginning with you, okay? A practical, stable, secure new beginning with you. In your feelings, you have the strength. So it looks like you're holding back from this person, okay? Trying to tame your emotions. Whilst this person out here, this person could be waiting for you to come towards them, okay? But now they're fed up of waiting. Now we'll see if they're fed up of waiting and taking action towards you or they're just fed up of waiting and leaving. Nine of Pentacles in reverse has the mutual energy. So you both could be wanting to be... Either you're both very focused on your uh, financial independence, okay? But you're both struggling financially, okay? Or you're both just very insecure and needy. Or could be just one of you, okay? King of Pentacles, it reverses the action you plan on to taking. So it looks like you're very focused on your money, career, growth, business, etc. Okay? You're being very greedy with your energy. Could be some. You're probably someone who's non-committal or someone who's just not wanting to offer this person anything stable right now. Or you're just focused on your own growth. Nine of Wands in reverse is their energy. They're saying screw it because they're already saying three of Wands here, okay? So they're very close to closing the cycle. And all this is because probably you're holding back. And probably this person thinks things are not fair. Well, we'll see. All right. Tell me why is the justice in reverse? What is the justice in reverse? Two of Wands. Yeah, something's not fair. And someone needs to make a decision, okay? With the Ace of Wands here. Yeah, so someone definitely needs to make a decision about whether they want a brand new beginning or not, okay? The Justice in Reverse is lacking accountability, but at the same time, something's not balanced. Something's not fair. You could feel someone's cheating, okay, lying, or this is just someone who's just not um, uh, trying to rectify a situation, okay? But this is that balance that is required, which is not happening. Why is the Five of Cups here in this person's mind, on Sagittarius's mind? Yeah, Fool in Reverse. You think this person is risky business. You don't trust them. You want a brand new beginning with this person, okay? But you're so disappoint disappointed with what happened in the past. You're just not ready to take a risk again. You're not ready to take that leap of faith with this person. You're hurt. Five of Cups is a very traumatizing energy, okay? It's like almost like a post-breakup energy where you're still moping. Ace of Pentacles. Why does this person have the Ace of Pentacles on their mind? Four of Wands in reverse. Yeah. After probably things have ended between you guys. Okay. This person wants a brand new start with you. Okay. Four of Wands in reverse is this person probably is someone who's like literally, you know, things could have ended. Five of Cups in reverse on their mind. This person. So you're both in the Five of Cups energy. You're still moping over it. You're still upset, sad. Uh, regretting etc okay this person has already is done with that phase and now they want to restart with you okay they want to restart this connection with you and they want a brand new passionate beginning they want a clean slate with you although there's been a breakup here there's this disharmony okay uh, lack of balance between you guys but they still want to try again what's the strength here <clears throat> what's the strength here in Sagittarius's feelings yeah a lot of watching, spying, looking at this person, but everything from a distance. This is just a lot of stalking, but no communication. You know, that's what you're doing. That's why you're holding back from this person. With a magician here, you could secretly be manifesting this person at the same time, okay? But with a strength here, you have a lot of feelings for this person, okay? But you're just not wanting to invest. You know, you're just like trying to show them that you can stay away from them and you're trying to uh, suppress your emotions is what I'm getting, Okay? in a good way because you just feel the need to resist yourself from this person so yeah you're watching them but there's no communication from your side why is the three of wands in reverse here all right they're waiting on a commitment probably okay with the hierophant here this person probably wants commitment with you okay four of pentacles this person's trying to give up on you okay or they have but at the same time they're holding on to you so weird this person's giving up on the thought of wanting a commitment with you okay so yeah this person does want something very stable they have more stable committed energies on their side okay whilst you're just watching and not being able to take a risk okay and that's why things are not balanced because someone needs to make a decision you are waiting for someone to make a decision or someone's making you wait 
and keeping you dangling okay it's like a situation where someone's just sitting on the fence and not making a decision of whether they're in or out okay that's what's happening here but this could be a long distance relationship also it does not have to be but someone just feels things are just not fair so yeah this person's literally giving up on the idea of ever having a commitment with you because they're very traditional okay but they're waiting for this and it's just not happening Again, with the four of wands in reverse also is what I'm getting, okay? This could be something that was very close to having a commitment, okay? But for some for some reason, there's, there was like a fallout between you guys, okay? Now they want to restart. They definitely want this. Why is the nine of pentacles in reverse? Why is this a mutual energy? The lovers, you both have so much love for each other, okay? You do. This is, I love you, you love me, okay? But wheel of fortune in reverse, Someone's not learning their lessons is what I'm hearing, okay? Someone's repeating the same negative patterns. The cycle, you're, you're just going, you're just going in circles, okay? You're not doing what it takes to get a breakthrough in this relationship, okay? That's why the two of wands here and with the justice here in reverse. It's just not fair to the other person that you're keeping them on hold. That's what I'm getting here. But with the lovers here, there is a lot of love. You both have a lot of love for each other. One person is just not sure, okay, if they want to risk this, okay? Although there is a lot of love and disappointment on this side, okay? This person here wants this, okay? They want a new beginning. They're ready to do it. But they're just giving up on the idea of, of having something long-term with you because probably you're just not making that move towards them, okay? Why is the king of pentacles in reverse here as the action you'll take? The justice, okay, so you, according to you, the way you're going to bring balance is by the emperor here. You're going to take control of the situation, bossing up, taking control of your life, okay? You're being very, very logical right now. Again, you have a lot of emotions for this person, but you're suppressing your emotions, trying to be very, very uh, balanced in your actions. And with the justice here, you want things to be fair. You want that equal give and take. But at the same time, you're just going to choose to focus on yourself because you probably think that's the right thing to do, Okay no longer uh, wanting to give in to this person or, you know, no longer wanting to get into the temptations or feed the temptations, okay? You're just going to hold back right now because you've experienced too much of heartbreak, too much of disappointment with this person here, okay? Whereas this person wants this new beginning with you, okay? They're just not sure. You know, they're not sure because three of wands in reverse here. You know what? Three of wands in reverse and hierophant can also mean that they're no longer waiting, okay? And they're wanting this commitment with you. Give me one more card here with the three of wands in reverse and the hierophant here. Give me one more card for the three of wands in reverse. Why is the three of wands in reverse and the hierophant here? Why is the three of wands in reverse and the hierophant here? Nine of cups in reverse. Yeah, see, it's killing them. You know, you're like a wish come true for them. But the thing is that they're giving up on the idea. That's what they're, they're saying. They're giving up on the idea. They're no more longer waiting for you to come towards them, to commit to them. You know? Or they're just losing faith. Okay, that things will ever be okay between you guys. And this is getting them emotionally very, very drained. They're getting very drained out emotionally. You you are like a wish fulfillment for them, but it's just that they're waiting and they just wait. They just feel it was for nothing. Someone needs to make a choice here of whether they want to maintain being single, okay, or on their own, or whether they want to have a deeper commitment with the other person. That's what I'm getting here. All right, why is the nine of wands in reverse as this person's action? Why is the Nine of Wands in reverse as this person's action? Six of Swords in reverse, yeah. This person, <clears throat> they're letting, you know, they're, 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 they're fed up. Okay, they're fed up of whatever's going on. But at the same time, they can't move on. Great. They can't even move on. They, they, they want to talk to you, but they won't even make a move towards you. They're just wanting to stay stuck where they are. Four of swords, a lot of thinking, a lot of analyzing about what's going on with the situation, but no communication. Temperance and reverse here. They're losing patience. They're losing patience. They don't know what to do about it. This is someone who's very impulsive, very reckless. You know, they can't wait for the right time. They're not waiting for divine timing. That's why they're giving up three of wands in reverse here. This is someone who wants things now. Okay, they're lacking patience. While you, on the other hand here, you're not making any move towards them, okay? You're just watching. So you're both at a standstill. Stalemate is what I'd say. Why is the Knight of Wands in reverse? He has the best potential outcome for Sagittarius. Clap for the Knight of Wands in reverse. Strength in reverse. Okay. Give me one more card. Why is the Knight of Wands in reverse and the Strength in reverse? 
Why is the Knight of Wands in reverse and the Strength in reverse? Yeah. So there is a reconciliation out here, okay? Um, someone is impulsive out here, but I still do feel that lack of forward movement out here, okay? I think someone's walking away because they feel that the person's playing a lot of mind games with them, okay? You see this, right? With Strength in reverse. You both have... Str who had strength in reverse okay yeah see you have the strength upright they have the strength in reverse here so you're holding on as much as you can they're giving up okay this person's just fed i mean i'm getting a lot of fed up energy from this person they feel you're constantly playing mind games okay because there is no movement from your side right you're one moment you want them the next moment you don't okay so you're being very in and out in and out okay with the likely outcome here so that's what's happening here. And with the strength in reverse and the five swords in reverse, this person's choosing to walk away because they can't take it anymore, right? They feel they're going to wait forever and it's never going to happen. It's killing them to walk away or to give up on the situation, but they just have to, okay? Because in the past, I think with the four of wands in reverse, if this person could have tried to make things happen with you, they could be wanting commitment, okay? But you're someone who just is someone, you know, you're just someone who... Um, you know, needs a lot of, uh, let's say, like a guarantee, right? If things will work out or not. You just need to be very sure. You don't like to take a risk. Give me one card for the Ace of Pentacles and the Four of Wands in reverse. So I think this person is no longer being able to put in the effort, right? You want balance here, but at the same time, you're not even putting in the effort. You're not even uh, wanting to offer this person stable because probably your, your focus is more of your finances. Give me one more card for the Ace of Pentacles and the Four of Wands in reverse. Seven of Pentacles, yeah, see, that's what this person is waiting and watching, okay? They're trying to see, they're not going to put in any effort. They're emotionally very, very unavailable, emotionally completely shut off, okay? So what's happening here is this person is in real pain, okay? They've been wanting to do this with you over and over again, and now they're fed up of repeating the same cycle, okay? And you, on the other hand, you refuse to take a risk, refuse to take that leap of faith with this person. Which is why this person is just giving up, okay? They're tired of manifesting you. That's what I have for you guys. I hope this reading resonates. If it resonates, do like, share, subscribe, leave your comments below and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.